So I'm looking for Rabbi Rabinowitz's his office. I need to talk to him about these gushers. Grape juice concentrate. Where is it? Where is his office? Here we go. Rabbi Rabinowitz, I need to speak to you about these gushers. I'm here at the OU visiting Rabbi Nachum Rabinowitz, who is a senior rabbinic coordinator at OU Kosher. The reason why I'm visiting Rabbi Rabinowitz today is because Rabbi Rabinowitz is the one who is in charge of all the grape products that the OU gives certification for, whether it's wine, whether it's grape juice, and whether it's gushers. You may ask me, why in the world is Rabbi Rabinowitz involved in grape products and gushers? It's not because these are grape gushers. Rather, if you look at the ingredients, and Usher could zoom in, this has grape juice concentrate. And the question I always get is, when people see this, they look for some yellow sticker on top of it, which we could have a separate discussion about. But this has an OU that has grape juice concentrate, and they want to know, does grape juice concentrate that the OU produces have anything to do with the regular grape juice that's out there on the market? Is that a different process? Is there a different way that we give Ashkacha to this? I think this is a question that people always wonder about. I think it's amazing that the box holds together without that extra sticker to hold it in place. <laughs> but. <laughs> It's, let, me, let me explain it. I think where some of the concern comes in is as follows. When you're dealing with kosher sensitive products, of course meat and poultry, when you're dealing with cheese products, when you're dealing with grape wine products, the assumption is that these are made especially for the kosher community and these are not products which are broadly available to the national or international market. And of course, this is a product which is sold nationally. It's not designed specifically for the kosher market. So when you see this and you see grape juice, you wonder how can you have a grape juice which is kosher, which is used in a product which is sold nationally. And the answer is that we make, we have teams of mashkichim who are involved in some of the largest grape juice manufacturers around the world. The OU has teams of mashkichim who are involved in producing kosher grape juice. And of course, they're made much the way that any kosher wine or grape juice is manufactured, by Shomer Shabbos mashkichim, or I'd like to call them kosher workers because they're not there to supervise, they're actually there to, to, to do the work, to take over the positions, the jobs that would normally done, be done by factory workers. So. When you see a product like this, and it has the OU symbol on it, it's kosher grape juice manufactured under kosher conditions that are used in this product. Um, there, there are other similar products, let's say Heinz has a wine vinegar, a red wine vinegar, which is sold nationally, which is under the OU. What type of product? It's made with kosher wine. Use kosher wine to make the kosher wine vinegar. And that happens to be their product sold all over the, the United States. 